Hi guys, this is Sadiq from Rabin.com and in this video, we'll show you how to fix the issue of being unable to change the Netflix download location to SD card. So many users have said that they are unable to carry out this task even though they see the option to download the movies and TV series to the SD card. But when they tap on that option, the movie series and all those TV shows are still saved on their phone memory. They are not saved to SD card. So if, all, if you are also facing the same issue, then in this video, I'll show you a workaround using which you could easily rectify this issue. So let's get started. Do keep in mind that you will only be able to download the following shows. For instance, if you go to your phone, iPhone or Android phone, then go to my Netflix downloads, see what you can download and only the files or the videos you see there, you can only download that. Likewise, from your PC, go to the more, my downloads, find something to download and you could only download the, the files and the videos which are shown in the following sections. So with that in mind, let's get started. First and foremost, you will have to enable USB debugging on your phone. So go to the settings menu on your phone, then go to about phone and tap on build number seven times. You will get a prompt that you are now a developer. In case of Xiaomi, you will have to type on MIUI version. And in case of HyperOS, you will have to tap on OS version seven times. And with this, developer option should not be enabled. Now go to system or in case of Xiaomi, go to additional settings and you should now see the developer option go there and enable the toggle next to USB debugging you will get a prompt on your phone tap on ok if this is the first time you are enabling debugging you will also get an RC key prompt as well in that case tap on allow and with this debugging is enabled let's verify the same for that you will have to download the Android SDK platform tools from my guide as well so get it from my guide and extract them onto your PC you could extract them anywhere you want in my case I have done the extraction in C drive and these are the files for platform tools once you have done the extraction, go to his address bar, type in CMD and hit enter. This will launch command prompt inside platform tools. Now type in ADB devices and make sure that you are getting a serial ID. If you are not getting any ID, then unplug and replug your phone from the PC. Disable and re-enable USB debugging. Tap on revoke USB debugging. Use the official USB cable that came with your phone and use the USB 2.0 port on your PC. So carry out this USB tweaks and make sure that you are getting an ID. Once you are getting this ID, let's now move ahead. So moving on, if your phone is a OnePlus phone running on Oxygen OS 12 or higher version, then you would also have to enable the disabled permission, permission monitoring toggle. So go to developer option and enable the toggle next to disabled permission monitoring. Likewise, in case of Xiaomi phones, you will again have to go to the developer option and then tap on reset to default values five times. Once you do so, you will get an option to turn on MIUI optimization. So you will have to turn off the toggle of this. I am again repeating tap on reset to default value five times and you will get an option which is named turn on MIUI optimization. You will have to turn off this toggle, then wait for five seconds and tap on accept. And with this MIUI optimization will be turned off. Once that is done, let's now proceed ahead. One more thing on Xiaomi phones, you will also have to turn off the USB debugging security settings. So also turn off this option in case of Xiaomi, you have to turn off two options, the USB debugging secure settings as well as the turn on MIUI optimization, both should be turned off. In case of OnePlus and Vivo Oppo phones, you will also have to turn off disable permission, permission, permission monitoring. For that, simply enable the toggle next to this option and the permission monitoring will be disabled on your phone. So with that said, let's now move ahead. And now what you have to do is simply Type in the command ADB de devices, which we have done. So we are getting a serial ID. Finally, you just have to type in this command and it will give the external storage access to the Netflix app. This is the app package name and this is the Android permission with regards to the right external storage. So it's getting the right access to the SD card. This is the right access to the SD card. And this is the app package name, which is com Android media client, which is the com Netflix media client, which is the Netflix app. And over here, it's the grant permission. So simply copy this entire command and paste it in the CMD window and hit enter. And with this, the Netflix app has been given the SD card storage access. Now simply go to this location as I've shown earlier. If you're on your phone, then go to my Netflix download, see what you can download and now try to download the file and you will now easily be able to download on the SD card. So right. guys, on that note, I round off this video. If you still have any queries, do let me know in the comment section and thanks a lot for watching.